So that incorrigible old rogue, Kick the BJ, posted a video the other day asking you to talk about the five monsters that you meet most regularly in your day to day life. And um, as you may know, my bedroom is full of the little blighters, so I thought I'd take you through a bit of a rogues gallery of my top meddlesome monsters that inhabit my immediate area. First up is the clothes gobbler. Not only does this cheeky chappy like to steal socks out of washing machines so you can never find a pair, but he also likes to nibble holes in some of my favourite tops. Look at that. If only I had hundreds of extra arms to fill in the tiny little holes. One of the most helpful monsters a YouTuber can have living with them is an editor bug. Of course, my editor bug is about six foot tall and tends to sleep under my bed and gosh, sometimes he is so... Another monster or should I say monsters, that I found useful in my day-to-day -day life, are the 40 fearsome fire fairies from the far-off forests of Flipnip 5, who I managed to fight fearfully, fortuitously, until one day I found they were my friends. Or at least, not foes. I like to keep them in my bedroom and use them to light up the night when there isn't a full moon to see by. Then there's Clyde, the crate monster. He lives in my treasure chest and helps keep all my secret codes, plunder, and other, hmm, unseen objects from prying eyes. He also loves to eat cornflakes. Last up is the incredible Jasper, the extremely lucky electron monster. Small enough to travel on particulate waves that make up the internet. If you're watching this, then he's probably already sped out of your computer into your bedroom to brighten your day, make your life a little bit luckier, and then return to me. That's all five then, so bye-bye, see you later, and ta-ta for now.